Happy Friday, everyone. It is Friday, September 6th. It is 1.20 p.m. And I think the temperature should be around 22 degrees Celsius. And I'm here on Finch Avenue East in the borough of North York. And I'll be looking west all the way towards Young of Finch. And you can see the North American Center just off in the distance. That's on the northwest corner of Young of Finch. And, and that building connects directly into a Finch station on line one. And not long ago, I just got off a westbound 39 Finch East bus, my home route, that brought me all the way here from Domo's Road. And as you guys may tell, I am back at Wolford Avenue. And I, and I remember about a month ago, I recently did a walking video along Wolford Avenue from Shepherd to here. So I'm in the neighborhood of East Willowdale. And just on the right will be the neighborhood of Newton Broke East, which is um, which is between uh, Finch and Steels and between Bayview and Young. So between those four streets that I mentioned just now are in the is in the neighborhood of East Newton Broke. Or should I say Newton Broke East? <laughs> So yeah, it's a cloudy day, and you don't see that many, uh, you don't see that many uh, clear blue skies, just uh, clouds, no sunshine. And I think, according to the forecast, um, I'll let this uh, loud truck <laughs> pass by. And according to the forecast, um, I think it might rain in the next couple of hours. I'm not sure to be honest, but hopefully, hopefully, hopefully during my walking video, um, I don't get wet <laughs> because, um, again, I, I did not bring my umbrella, but oh well. So yeah, as I was saying, um, I remember doing a walking video along Wilford about a month ago from Shepherd to Finch, and I'll definitely link that video down in the description below this video so you guys can um, feel free to check that recent video out. Um, it was recorded back on August 9th of this year. Oh look, there goes, there goes another garbage truck heading south along Wolford. And there is the 39B Finch East 9235. Oh, so I was, I was, I was on that unit 9235 um, when I boarded from Domus Road to Finch and Wilford that begins south of Finch Avenue East. That's, that's, that's the same bus um, I was on before. But yeah, so for this video, I'll be going for a walk along Wilford, heading south on the east side from here to Shepherd Avenue East. And before I get going, <laughs> First look east along Finch towards Bayview Avenue. So again, I am not too far from where I live. And, 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 and as you can see, um, along this stretch of Finch, um, it's very peaceful. You don't see, you don't see that many humans on the sidewalk because you know because I'm in the suburbs area, just way north of downtown. So let's hope that it does not rain, even though even though I do not bring my umbrella. And here on and, and here on the north side of Finch Avenue East, they got some nice homes. Some s some houses are old and some are new. I think these houses, I think these houses over there, across the street, I think I think they were built probably in the early 1970s or 80s. Not sure, but I, but but around those years. And I can see. Willowdale Avenue just up ahead. I remember, I remember doing it. I remember doing a walking video along Willowdale over a month ago. So yeah, I mean we're already in September finally, September six. I can't I can't believe that we're already in September, and and days are and days are flying way too fast. I mean time does go by. I mean time does go by quickly. So yeah, so so yeah. Um, let's take, let's take a stroll down 
Wilford Avenue in, in, in the neighborhood of East Willowdale. So the last time I, I recorded a walking video along Wilford, I was walking north on the west side. Now this time, we're walking south on the east side of Wilford Avenue. It's a very nice street. And this week is a very short week because um, this past Monday, September 2nd was a Labor Day. It was a holiday. So this week is a short week and especially during um, the first week of school after, after um, um, summer, after the two month, after, after the two months of summer vacation, this says Olive Avenue. And that will and that will and that will um, lead you west to uh, Young Street, which is way over in that direction. But still, it's, it, it's very um, humidity. You know, I mean, it's a bit hot, but not quite. I really, I really like um, this house here on the right. I like how the balcony is set up, but but it's very uh, empty balcony, and I don't think nobody, I don't th like I don't think I don't think that nobody um lives in that house, but I mean, I mean I can tell that I mean I I can tell that this house looks really, really really um expensive. It's a very uh, quiet neighborhood along Wilford Avenue. So 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 this this will be my second time recording. A video along Wilford, along the stretch. And today being September 6th is the second day of TIFF, which, which stands for the Toronto International Film Festival. And I, and I do plan on to, to check out the TIFF tomorrow and Sunday. So the TIFF festival runs from September 5th to September 15th which means all of next week will be TIFF crossing Holmes Avenue looking west all right we'll do well let's look north along with it towards Finch Avenue East where I began my video. And very um very recently um I saw those uh I, I saw those new arts kid flyer buses operating on my on my express home routes the 939 Finch Express because um I because I, I've seen so many uh, long buses operating on the 939 uh, Finch Express operating from Canyon Station to Finch West Station via Finch Station and Scarborough Center Station. Because I remember that before um, the Novas would operate on the 939 uh, Finch, Finch Express, but then um, but then um, the TTC um, decided to um, run long buses on the uh, 939 uh, Fish Express since um, since a lot since a lot of people um, use used um, use the express to to get from point A to point B. So that that's why and and, and that's why the um, the express buses they get really 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 packed with people. So that's why they so that's why the 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 CDC needs to um needs to add more buses, add more long buses. I mean, along Finch, so that um so that there will be um 
plenty of room for other folks um, to fit in. So that's probably so that's, so, so that's probably the case. Dunn Forest Avenue. And I'm surprised that after the first 11 minutes, I have not encountered any dinguses. Not even, not even like one dingus. Because, uh, because, uh, because, because um, I think this neighborhood is a very nice neighborhood. Not full of <laughs> dingus encounters over here. And but yeah, it's very it, it's a very uh, quiet street. You no, know, just very peaceful. And and um. It's not as peaceful as downtown. <laughs> because downtown is always noisy with like full of cars, people, a lot of sort of thing. All the liveness <laughs> around downtown. Especially at um, Dundas Square. Where you'll see a lot of humans and a lot of blasting music. This is uh, Dunview Avenue. So I'm between Bayview, just just to the left, and Willowdale, to, and Willowdale, um, to the right. <laughs> so again, all the stretch here is East Willowdale. They got some really nice uh, houses here. Just, just love those houses. They look uh, brand new, or not quite. I mean, I mean, I, I mean, these houses have been here for quite a long time. <clears throat> and finally, the weekend is upon us because you know. <laughs> This week, I mean, this week again has been a short week. And school began this past Tuesday, the third day of September. And and finally it's a weekend. And I also can't believe that we're all, and I can't believe that we're, that we're already in, already. <laughs> like, I can't believe that <laughs> Um, it's, it's already Friday. This is what I meant to say. I almost stumbled. I almost stumbled my words for a sec. Oh, there is the orange sign that says Shepherd Avenue Lane reduced from Young to Bayview from May to October. Mackey Avenue So again, Willow Avenue is just a few blocks west of here and Bayview Avenue is just over there looking east and it, It's not even that chilly outside Even though that's according to the forecast that, that um, it might rain. Well, I guess not though.
And because that, um, and because Wolford Avenue is not a very uh, busy street, I don't think that Wolford Avenue needs um needs to add uh, bike lanes, in my in my opinion. Because um, I mean, I mean, there's already a sidewalk on on each side, so 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 no need for them to uh, to add um two bike lanes on each corner, on each side. I mean, since um since this street is not even a very busy street, like it's, it's not like um. It's not like um, Bayview, Young, or Finch or Seals, where it's always, always full of cars, trucks, buses. Like, especially on Young Street, which is one of the world's um, largest streets in Canada. I think, I, I think Young Street in North York needs to add bike lanes. I, I know that they recently added bike lanes along Young between, I think between um, Eglinton and I believe Bloor. But then uh, further south than Young, just south of just south of Bloor, um, you don't see bike lanes. So, and, and so, so in um, in my opinion, they should they should add more bike lanes along the whole entirety of Young Street, from the lake, all in north up to, let's say Newmarket or something. Ooh, interesting. Some very neat uh, Danny Lyons. <laughs> I love Danny Lyons. But again, we're still in summer because summer ends on September 21st. I believe that in in about two weeks from, from today. Yeah, yeah, I, I, at least two weeks before before the official summer season ends, before we enter fall. I mean, this year has been a very great summer, despite that. Um, despite that, um, nothing bad has ever happened to us, and and of course, and of course, especially during the triple team meetup, which was at least two or three weeks ago. That was fun times during the during the summertime, and I really had a very great time myself. As we're crossing uh, Kingsdale Avenue, looking west. <clears throat> All right, so what do you want us to look? At Wolford Avenue, looking north towards Finch. I'm surprised that, that I'm the only one <laughs> that's recording a video along Wolford, but not but not um, anyone else. Because well, again, almost all, all my viewers are at school, so that's why, <laughs> and, and that's why you don't see many kids. Because it, because it's a school day, the sixth day of school of 2024. And this is Empress Avenue. Oh, Jesus, that Porsche was <laughs> came too fast. Now it's getting a bit lively. Empress and Wolford. <laughs> yeah, and as soon as I was crossing the street, um, uh, I, I think I think that Dodge that was heading east 
almost was coming towards me. <laughs> like, 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 I mean, that dodge didn't even wait for me to finish crossing. I mean, I don't get how these drivers, they, they, they don't have any, any patience at all. Look what I see, there is Princess Avenue. <laughs> and speaking of Princess, one of one of Henry's viewers. <laughs> one of Henry's viewers who's Princess Margaret. She's a very awesome supporter of my channel. Henry's Cans and Johnny's. As well as Liam's channel too. But imagine as but imagine this street was called Prince Avenue instead of Princess. <laughs> that would that would have been um very funny. Even though that um even even though even though that um I have a viewer named uh Princess Margaret. Again and again she's an awesome again and again she's an awesome she's 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 an awesome supporter of uh my channel and Liam's and Henry's and Johnny's and Ken, Johnny's and Ken's. Oh, and now the wind is picking up. Just a slight wind. Oh, that white, that white van just parked. And blocked the, the sidewalks, now I have to go around it. As we're approaching uh, Hillcrest Avenue. Yeah, it's a very nice uh, street. A very nice street of Hillcrest Avenue. Oh, look, and, and I can barely see Baby Avenue looking east. Just off in that direction. Alright, Elmwood Avenue. And I think I remember right in front of this house is when um was when um I, I, the kids were asking if I was live streaming. But then but then I was like no, I'm I'm just recording a video. And they're like and they're like, oh cool, what's what's your name? And 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 I, and I gave them my channel and all that sort of thing. I mean, those kids that I ran to weren't even dinguses. I mean, they're they're, they're just asking if, if I was um, live streaming, and I was like, no, just a video for YouTube. <laughs> so yeah, right from so it's right from that house on the northwest corner of Elmwood and Wilford. But yeah, it's a very nice street though. And I ha and I highly recommend you guys to to check out Wolford Avenue and and do and do a walking video or, or a live stream. I mean I mean either or is fine. I mean the I mean it doesn't really matter if you can do if you can do a walking video or a live stream along Wolford. For me for for me um I chose to do a walking video along Wolford instead of, instead instead of a live stream. So that's that. And.
but yeah along this stretch of, of um Wolford Avenue I, I almost forgot to say this <laughs> it's full it's filled with some nice houses homes some re residential streets all that sort of thing and and all the um the resident and, and all the um res residential uh, communities here too Hollywood Avenue <laughs> and I think I really see I, I, I can barely see Shepherd Avenue East just off in the distance looking south that's where I, that's what I'm heading to so I should arrive at Shepherd Avenue East in the next 12 minutes or maybe in the next 15 minutes. Or maybe 12 to 15 minutes is what I meant to say. Now oh, that's a, a, a very neat house. You see, all these houses that you see, um, they're not really, they're, they're not really attached houses. They're just um just um they're just separate homes because because w because when you see an attached house like those like, like those 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 attached houses are attached to one another but because but, but because um these houses that you see are not attached they're just um separate homes crossing all fred avenue So yes, I can see Shepherd Avenue East coming up, and on the left will be the People's Church, as well as the Farmer's Market. All right, now we're now we're approaching Spring Garden Avenue, and again, there's like so many nice houses here. But again, I, I can't even afford buying a house because um, these houses they cost a lot of money. But yeah, I am curious to hear your thoughts and comments down below this video, and and do and do let me know what you think, what you guys think about a very nice, peaceful street of Wolford Avenue in the neighborhood of East Willowdale. Is it a nice street? Is it bad? Is it good? You know, you know, you know, you know, you know I, I'm very, I'm, I'm very curious to to hear your thoughts about 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 um. What do you guys think of the stretch of Wolford Avenue in East Wildell? Because, um, because, because, in my opinion, Wolford Avenue is a very nice street in East Wildell, and I see a squirrel. <laughs> and Alex, if you're watching this, I know you. I know you um, really love squirrels. <laughs> One of uh, one of Alex's favorite. Huh. 
I love squirrels. In fact, I remember um, when I was a kid, I think I was, I think when I was like 10 years old or nine years old, I was, um, I was, I was, I was feeding a squirrel some food, but then all of a sudden the squirrel kind of, kind of bit my, uh, bit my, bit my arm there. It kind of like bit my arm and that was really uh, painful as we're crossing uh, Greenfield Avenue. So yeah, that squirrel, huh? well actually, um, that squirrel, huh? um, the, the, one, the one I was feeding when I was like nine or, nine or 10 years old, it kind of bit my arm. And, 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 I, was, and, and I was bleeding so much because, um, because, because squirrels, because their claw because, are very sharp and, you know, and um, yeah, that was that was like way back way back then. But now we've arrived at Shepherd Avenue East, just above Line Four. Yep. So so this is the farmers market, and it only runs from May twenty fourth until October fourth between the hours of 9 a.m. and 4 p.m. The finest selection of artisanal, artisanal uh, cheese. Ooh. Very nice. I mean, the farmer's market looks a bit lively and I remember that the last time when I did it when I did the walking video along Wilford Avenue the farmers market was was a bit was a bit busier than it is now but yeah here's where I began my video um, the last time when I first did a, did, did, did a walking video along Wilford. So it took at least 30 minutes to walk from Finch and Wilford to Shepherd. And just and just off in that direction will be the Highway 401, one of North America's busiest highways in Canada. And after a while, there's still a lot of traffic along Shepherd above Line 4. Yeah, here it is. The farmers market open now from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. from May 24th until October 4th, and that and that means since 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 um today is um September 6th, um the farmers market will will close down after October 4th, which will be in about a month. So after so after October 4th. There will be no farmers markets on Fridays until May 24th. But yeah, I mean, it does look a bit lively. I mean, you don't hear any music, which is uh, pretty good. You know, one day on a Friday, I do I do want to come back here with, with my family and probably um, and probably do some outdoor <laughs> grocery shopping. Maybe I can buy some. Maybe maybe I can buy some fruits, vegetables, watermelons. I mean, I mean, I mean, um, all that sort of thing. But here at, at the farmers market, I would normally get maybe I'll buy some maybe, maybe I'll buy some apples, oranges, um, what else, what else? Carrots, broccoli. I mean, you name it. I mean, I mean, there's like so many, there's like so many um different items you can buy from. But uh, yeah. Oh yeah, and as of. As of this past Sunday, which was the first day of September, September the 1st, um, the 185 Shepherd Central is now operating along Shepherd Avenue East between uh, Shepherd Young Station to the west and Domo Station looking east. So, so that has replaced the 85 
Shepard East routes. Um, but but the but the 85 Shepard East is still available. It only it only operates from Dumbo Station to um to Meadowville. That would be the 85B, which 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 used to be the 85C. Yeah. I think I, I think I think both both are branches. But then um but again still the 85A is still available and that operates from Dharma Station to Rushilko Station. And now and, and and also another thing as of the first day of September, the 904 uh, Shepherd Canyon Express has been recently has been recently um replaced with um, the 985A Shepherd East, East Express. So, but but I think the, but, but I think that the 985B is still available. That's the express route, and that runs from uh, Dharma Station east to Meadowville. So yeah, that's my so that is my information. In case you guys didn't know. So yeah, we're at we're almost at the. 37 minute mark so here's where i'm going to end my video so it has been a fun walk and i want to thank you all so much for watching and don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe if you haven't already i have an instagram account at japan ttc explorer and there is also a super thanks button that's that's below this video if you wish to support my channel that way so so it has been a fun walk along wolford avenue So this was my second time doing a walking video along Wolford Avenue in the very nice neighborhood of East Willowdale. Oh, and I can see the 185 Shepherd Central. And I'm not sure why they, I, 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 I'm, I'm not sure why that the TTC renamed the 85 Shepherd East to the 185 Shepherd Central. I think I think because um I think I, I think I know why to be honest because um since that um since that the 185 Shepherd Central operates between Domino's and Shepherd Young above line four, maybe that's why maybe that's why they renamed they renamed the I mean they renamed um the current 85 that, that used to operate from Shepard Young to Don Mills to the 185 Shepard Central and, and I think the 185 used to be the Don Mills Rocket before they, re they renamed it to the, the 925 Don Mills Express since back in 2018 if I can easily remember and all that sort of thing so yeah but here looking west you can see the North York skyline looking west towards Young and Shepard which is also one of the busiest intersections in North York, in my home world. So yeah, so yeah, um, nothing else to be said. So hope you all have an have an awesome Friday and um, enjoy and, and, and enjoy the rest of um, and, and enjoy the rest of the month of September. And I'll be maybe 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 I might wait for the, the next one eighty five Shipper Central because because I do want to capture it. On video before before I end it, that's the that's an Orion NG hybrid from from the Melbourne division, number one six zero three. Oh, and the bus, and, and, and I think the bus is not that busy. The one eighty five uh, Shepherd Central. Unit 1603. The wall leaf. Yeah, so I'll wait for the next 185 to arrive. I mean I, I mean I'm not in a rush. And I'll be and I'll be hopping on the, the next 185 Shepherd Central heading west towards the uh, Shepherd Young Station. And that should be at least a um that should be at least a, a, a 10 minute bus ride from here to Shepherd Young Station since I'm not too far from Shepherd Young. But yeah, have a great have a great Friday afternoon slash evening and enjoy the weekend that's that, that's upon us. And we will see you guys next time. And and again I'm glad that it didn't rain, otherwise I would have been soaking wet 
even though even though I forgot to bring my umbrella. But anyways, I will see you guys. I will see you guys next time. Adios.